Monday Night Football, maybe Monday Night Football. We start on top of the hill at Duluth Marshall, where the Hermantown Hawks took the quick trip east. The Hawks have only lost one game so far this season in eight contests. And the Hawks also haven't lost since their very first game of the year. And after a one to nothing shutout win today over the Hilltoppers, Hermantown is now on a seven game unbeaten streak. The win today solely on the back of sophomore goalie Ethan Asta, who made a handful of big saves in the second half to keep Marshall off the board. Hermantown now heads to Grand Rapids to play the Thunderhawks on Thursday, while Marshall heads to Hibbing on Friday. A similar story down the tracks in Proctor, where the Rails girls soccer team ran into the wall that is two Harbors goaltender Ashlyn Cavillan. This was a true defensive battle between two veteran teams as both squads were fighting for their third win of the season. When I left at halftime, it was still 0-0, so if you know how this game ended, please let us know. The Agates play again tomorrow in Esco, while the Rails don't play again until Thursday when they take on the Cloquet Lumberjacks. And those Lumberjacks were also in action tonight over at Duluth Denfeld, taking on the one-win Hunters. Sophomore midfielder Mackenzie Lynch finds a seam and just dribbles that ball in ever so slowly into the net to give Cloquet the lead. They would end up winning in shutout fashion two to nothing. The Lumberjacks return home on Thursday when they take on Proctor while the Hunters remain at home on Thursday as well for the Duluth Derby taking on Duluth East. And speaking of 